Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. Of course, it's going to be Lumber. That's what I play, right? And that's what you guys enjoy. So hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, um, just saying, and stay here longer than four minutes because we're going to have some fun. All right. I'm going to go up here and I'm going to build, and we're going to go take a look and see how far we are along because. If I remember right, I've got a bunch of ladders up there, and we gotta make those ladders. No, 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 I've already set all the ladders. We gotta set the, uh... oh my goodness, stop, stop. The lag, seriously. Like, this is, this is incredible. Sin money, no, thank you. No, thank you. Me, noob, send money. No, I don't want to. Thank you. Thank you. Twitter, the Twitter went off. Did you hear the Twitter bird? Oh, poor Rumba. It's too easy to make money in this game for me to send you some. Now, go and work hard. I know you can do it. Encourage him. You know, he's new. He, it's cool. Send him on his way. And he'd be happy. <clears throat> I have a feeling that we're going to have an episode of this guy asking for monies and then doing something when I don't give it to him. Uh oh. My goodness. The lag is killing me! Why lag? Why? Code, you sound like an old man there. Yes, I know. Oh, he sent me a friend request. <laughs> uh, decline. No, thank you. Bob wants to know if he can help. Uh, did you help out last time? Yeah, I don't mind. That's cool. Whitelist, Mr. Bob. Boom. There you go. Place up here. So I'm still really excited about um, going to PAX and I was looking up the competition today. Got to go and, and see some of their channels. Subscribe to all of them. Amazing people. The ones I could find. Wait, didn't I say this already? I think I said this in today's video. Or yesterday's video. I think. Cool bridge. Thank you. I appreciate it. Tomb Raider, what are you doing over there? Sorry, R Roomba. Roomba. That's an interesting name. He is the Bacon Hair. So. But, Bacon Hair Army. Everyone unite. Place up here. You put them all in. I'll place them. How about you put them and I'll place them? How's that sound? Here, let's head, let's head up there. I do need to take a look before we get started because if I'm putting them in the wrong spots, that's going to be a problem. And I, like I said, I think I still have a bunch of um, ladders to get going. Night killer. Kill Ray. Thank you for joining me. I'm glad I got to sign your base. <clears throat> they gotta go to bed. So I decided that I would sign the base before the video started. And uh, I've already got some practice in. Um, I think the internet might be acting up on me because I go to play uh, Soul Calibur 6 in very hard mode offline. I do great. I can, I can kick butt 75% of the time 
on very hard mode. And that's that's an achievement in itself. So I'm I'm pretty proud of that. Um, but I go to play online and I get my butt spanked. I'm this it's horrible. It's like I, I was uh, I didn't turn in my homework or something. It was bad. So I don't know what to do. <clears throat> Again, I'm going to blame the internet. <laughs> oh my gosh, good hi. Hi there. I would say how are you, but it's it's one of those arbitrary things that like I don't know if that's the right word. Um salutations and small talk I don't do very well with. And I explained this um a few days ago in one of my code drive times. Um I'm just not good at it. Like um whenever I'm at work and I know a lot of a lot of my coworkers follow me and a lot of my coworkers watch me. <laughs> Thank you. Why, thank you. I appreciate it. And they'll understand what I'm talking about because it, it feels that way when I'm at work too. Like people will say, good morning. I'm like, good morning. And then they'll say, how are you? I'm like, do you really want to know? I mean, were you just asking to be nice or... Okay, I'll stop using caps. <laughs> that's good. Um, but that's that's what I'm talking about. Like, I'm... I'm not really good with small talk. I don't I don't know the proper response for how are you doing today? Because I mean, if I'm having a bad day, do I tell you about it? And, and are we close enough that I should be like giving you my interrelational personal details about myself? Um, I, I don't, I don't know. Uh, it gets awkward pretty quick. And it might just be awkward on my end, but I, that's the way I feel. I don't really know you, so I mean, we work together. That's cool. Um, how are you today? I don't know. I normally don't ask back. Sometimes the people are like, how are you? I'm doing great. And then I won't say, how are you doing? Because it's, it's not that I don't care. It's just, it's one of those small conversation things. It's a piece of conversation. It's, it's, and trust me, I know all about wasted talking. Okay. I do YouTube and that's not wasted talking, not all the time, but I can continuously talk about things, even like in this video right now, specifically stating that I talk about things inside videos. Like that is something of a gift I can do. And it's, did I miss that up? I did not, okay. And it's just a, it's a thought. One of my random thoughts that I have. Oh goodness. Bob. Are you recording? Hey Bob, I saw this base in a video of codes. It's because this is my bet base. Or Bob's base. Bob's base is over there on slot three, I think. Or six. I'm gonna guess slot seven. Hold on. Okay. Uh what was that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I was right! I was right. GG code. Quick Shadow Lord, thank you so much for your subscribe. I appreciate everything that you do. So whenever I say thank you, I really do mean that. I, I mean thank you. Uh, if I ask you, how's your day or how, how's it going? That's one of the arbitrary, like, hey, it's part of the conversation. It's what I'm supposed to ask you. And it's not that I don't care. It's just extra talk, you know? Maybe, maybe that's the part of me that's, that's the ADHD part because I don't understand that. Um, and don't get me wrong. It's great for like small conversations and to fill the air whenever there's silence going on. But if it's just in passing, I don't, I don't understand that. You know, is, is it a courtesy? I, I think it's just a courtesy. Like if you were to say, good morning, they're like, good morning. I'm like, how are you? And then they start to say, well, and then you say, I really don't care. And that, would that be rude? <laughs> I mean, it, it would totally be rude. Um, even in my comment section, people are like, hi code, how are you today? I'm good. I made a video and you showed up to, to watch it. Thank you. I really do appreciate you being here to watch one of my videos for me, but I'm a very selfish person and I don't really want to tell you how I'm doing today. And, okay, 
Uh, if you don't remember, okay, hold on. I fell down. No way. Half an hour to get in here. I have not been recording for half an hour. It's only been like 10 minutes. Uh, I don't know if you remember me code, probably not, but I was playing some of the games with you a few weeks ago, like the spaceship shooting game uh, and Western game and exploring game. Yes, I remember. In fact, I, I made those games, so I'm very happy whenever people jump into them. Well, I didn't make the Western game. Western Redemption is done by uh, Magnum Developers, uh, which they have not developed on in quite some time. But Jack, I talk to on a regular basis. He's doing amazing now that he's away from his horrible job. The overseers of the hotel businesses. I don't know if that was too much information. But Jack, I'm very proud of you if you're watching this video. And I just wanted to say thank you for being my friend. And thank you for understanding my weird ways of the, like the, the arbitrary conversations. The stuff that I'm talking about right now. A lot of my admins will understand this, and a lot of my protégés can kind of understand this, but like, if you've been around in the Discord for a long time, you know that the small talk and the little concerns, stuff like that, it doesn't, doesn't fly with me very well. I just, I don't get it. So. And maybe I'm just heartless, who knows. A lot of you are going to be contradicting that statement and putting down below Code, you love your fans. They're amazing. You can see it in your videos. It's true. I do love my fans. I love you guys, okay? Um, and I love making videos for you. I love coming out here and playing video games. Did I not pick that up? I didn't pick that up. Okay, back down. But when the interim comes and... and hold on. Maybe... Did I do that right? Oh my goodness, okay. Big lag. <clears throat> I'm up. <laughs> Somebody asked, where's code at? I'm up. Just, just up. <laughs> up, 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 up. <laughs> I did pick it up. It was just a huge lag spike delay. Uh, anyhow, like I was saying, my admins understand um, my different approaches, which is why I trust them to like make awesome decisions and keep the Discord clean and family friendly. And we've loosened the rules like a lot since we began. Um, my offensible words list was ridiculous. I mean, completely ridiculous so like if you had commented something like oh my gosh code you killed it that word killed was restricted and your entire comment would be like gone um i had the word old because whenever i was first starting a bunch of people were just saying dude aren't you too old to be playing roblox aren't you too old 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 so i blocked the word itself and it destroyed the comments with the word old in it so whenever somebody was like, hey, isn't this an older video? It was like, gone. So yes, we have loosened it up a lot since I began. And I think it's because I'm a different person than whenever I first began the Roblox YouTube community. Oh, speaking of which, I think I'm the only Roblox YouTuber that's going to PAX East. Is that true? Is there anybody? out there um hit the sub button while you're there while you're looking around I, I know you were looking around because i started looking around and that just automatically makes you go what is he looking at the sub buttons right there just does it does it show my count um how many likes are down there comment it, it like at this particular point in time in this video right there just read off the the likes and then also put how many dislikes. At the time that you comment, say seven likes and two dislikes or something like that. And if it was seven and two just now, like when that happened, be like, oh my gosh, Code, you like predicted the future. 
I know, I know. After a few days and a few hours, that's not gonna be the case. It's probably gonna be like 200 dislikes and five likes or something like that. But in the event that it actually hit right when I said it, you can freak out and be like, oh my gosh, he's talking to me. That would be cool. I, I, I would be, like if you could record that moment, that would be, man. Could you imagine if I called it like that? Pfft. What's funny is like the, the title of the video over there, I don't even know what that is yet. Like as I'm recording this video right now, but not at the time that you're watching it because you're watching it in the future, but at the time that I'm recording it, I don't know what that title is going to be. I haven't even started it yet. I'm just recording and I'm not going to edit this thing. So, I mean, it's just going to be straight uploaded to the internet, but I, there, there's that I have like a template for my tags with lumber tags and stuff like that. Um, what are the suggestions over there? Like, what are you getting for your suggested videos? By the way, was there an ad that popped up? And if you saw it, what was it? Did you remember? These kind of things are the, the questions that I want to know. And they're very, those are very nonchalant, not real conversation words. Like you wouldn't normally ask that, right? Who cares? It was an ad or it was so many likes. Anyhow. Maybe that's why people like my channel. Just thinking. Boop. Wee. Move. And I know, I know that like I could get used to conversations like that. Just being like, how are you? I am good. How is the weather? Did you watch the game? Um, how are the kids? Stuff like that. But I don't know. Maybe I'm just a selfish individual. And don't get me wrong, if you know what ADHD is, if you have somebody, or if you live with somebody with ADHD, you will find out very quickly that we are very selfish individuals. Not that we mean to be, and not that we're being mean about it, but it's very true. Hi, Bob, how are you? Oh gosh. And it's not that we're selfish. I mean, we're, we're a little centered, oblivious to others. Uh, and it doesn't mean that we don't have empathy. I mean, we can definitely have empathy. I cry at the stupidest movies. And they're not stupid. They're emotional. Usually when it has to do something with like a parent, that gets me emotionally sad. Um, Mr. Rogers, he gets me upset. Well, not upset, but like emotional. Oh, hey, you made it. Good job. Are you okay if I stand back? Sure. Did you want a picture? Say hi. 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 Arigato gozaimasu. He's like, yes, I want a picture. Okay, are we standing this way? All right, there you go, buddy. Oh, oh, oh. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Dunsparse07 and his YouTube channel. It looks like he's got a, got a logo on there. So. Print screen. Done. Done. Are you with code? Yes. I'm up. <laughs> Huge lag spike delay. Uh, we haven't even built, uh, like I, I built a little bit on the ladders, but done. Thank you so much. You are welcome. Boom. By the way, if you've been diagnosed with ADHD and you feel the same way sometimes, you are absolutely normal. And don't get me wrong. I don't know if it's normal normality of like every human being. It could be. If you have not been diagnosed with ADHD and you feel the same kind of way about like <clears throat> emotional conversations where it's just small talk, comment down below. Let me know. I want, I want to know if I'm like the only person that feels that way. And it's not always. I mean, I've got a lot of friends that I hang out with and, and chat with, but it's usually not about the weather or how they're feeling, you know? Mm. 
It's about computers and games, mostly. Or hacking, hacking technologies. I, I talk to a lot of developers who are hackers and a lot of hackers who are developers, stuff like that. And don't be afraid of a hacker, okay? Be afraid of an exploiter who doesn't understand hacking. Those are the scary ones. Or be afraid of the, some, the person that's just like, that's all I'm going to do is cause mayhem on the internet. They'll grow up. That's okay. And if you're young and you're, you're causing all kinds of trolling happening, just remember, you'll grow out of it. And I want you to take that statement with a grain of salt. Because I know it's going to make a lot of people mad. Be like, oh, you, I'm going to comment something bad. Well, even the person that commented something bad down below, I have an automated bot that goes through and checks all the comments to see if there's anything nasty that goes on. And your comment's probably going to come to me in the first place. And those actually get more attention because I fuel them. <laughs> I will fuel conversations. And, and I've been trolling a lot longer than you have. <laughs> I've had some practice. I'm la lagging so hard. Same here. I think it's this server. And if it continues like this, I think I might just jump out. I mean, we've been at 20 minutes and I've, I've not really been having too positive influence of a conversation. But, and by the way, parents, you should be openly honest and, and talk the same way. Because um, I know people are like, oh, you're a grown-up, or oh, you're an adult. That doesn't mean... <laughs> you still have the same kind of mindsets, and parents and grown-ups and grandparents, we still mess up, all right? We're not perfect human beings, and there's stuff that we normally don't talk about or normally don't concern you with because we don't want to worry you. There's... There's a lot of worry in the world. You concentrate on being a kid or being a teenager and getting good grades and making friends and socializing because that's what you should do. Thanks code for hardening my comment, you're the best. <laughs> you are welcome. I'm unloading, no, it's going to destroy me. Don't unload, no. It's fine. It's cool. How many how many doors did we build? It's a lot of doors. Slowly but surely moving the bridge up. I want to climb and put them all up, but I know if I don't start to throw them up, then I'll never complete this old bridge. Oh my gosh, what happened there? I did not mean to put it right there. Do you want orange wood? I got a lot. No, thank you. I'm okay. I'm okay for now. I'm tired, you guys. Like, I, I am seriously tired. I think I stayed up too late practicing last night. <laughs> and I've already done some training today. Which was good. But I'm tired now. I'm a little upset because the online version just... I was not doing well at the network gameplays. <sighs> Welcome to this episode of Code Primate Sleeps on Camera. Put your head down, Code. People can see up your nose. What are you doing? Crazy. <laughs> yes. I do feel like I'm a little crazy. But, at the same time, I know that if you're really crazy, you don't know that you're crazy. And that right there tells me I know I'm not crazy. See what I did there? It's fun. <sighs> uh, I would give you some, but I guess everyone that gave me some is duplicate. That's fine. If you are not the person that duplicated the wood, I don't care. But if you are the one duping the wood and the axes and stuff like that, tell me. I'm just kidding. Don't tell me. Um, stop it. Don't duplicate. 
it ruins the economy. And a lot of people would be like, it's just a game. Well, yeah, to some people it's just a game. To others, I mean, they've spent hours upon hours of their life dedicated to this game to build something that you're just going to go and boop. Little unfair. And don't give me the, the runaround of, oh, well, if it was so bad, then he should have fixed it in the game. No. Just because it exists doesn't mean you have to use it. Okay, this is this is getting ridiculous. We're at 25 minutes. Oh my gosh. Did I place I didn't place it up there. Is this for me? Thank you. Open. 70 Ooh, where did it go? 73,000 Oh, 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 stop. Stop. <clears throat> Oh, set. Oh my gosh. That is lagging hardcore. 73, no, 730,316. Wow. That is a big number. Could you imagine if I could get my subscriber to count to that? Hey, there we go. No more uh, lumber videos until this video hits 703,000 likes. I would never do that. That would be horrible. Could you imagine? Could you imagine a YouTuber making a deal with you about the likes on their channel? Like a part two, get this channel or get this one too. That's begging for likes. And don't get me wrong. I ask you to like the video and comment and subscribe and stuff like that. But that's that singular call out that I do at like the end or the middle or beginning of the videos. I don't sit there and like make deals and threats to my fans for likes and subscribes. Hit that subscribe button right now or you're going to have a spider in your bed tonight. I despise those. You're straight up lying. It might be funny to some people because they understand it and stuff, but to a little kid or to like somebody with a mental disorder, you are straight up lying. And to me, that is wrong. I don't care if you are a YouTuber, and I don't care if you, you think that you're on top of the world and you, you're advancing your channel by doing so. It's yuck. <laughs> Sorry, that's my little rant. I should probably get off here. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> I know, I know. I said I was going to do it like just a 10 minute video, but it's already been like 27 minutes. Let's get the last of these doors up there. Let's not get distracted and let's finish out hard. Let's let's go. Hardcore. Hardcore door core. Don't you wish these would lock, you know? Could you could have somebody whitelisted but lock the door and then like there would be an item that would fall out whenever you did it and it would be a key and you'd have to place that key back into it to unlock the door and then you could be hey look I'm a dorky <laughs> sorry that was that was a long dad joke that didn't work work so if you if you cross a, a Dotson and a Yorkie dog you get a dorky and they're adorable Mm -mm. Mm. Oh, I did find something the other day. Hold on. <laughs> this this is something I said in the past, but it's it's funny. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, is that okay? Dang it! There it is. View image. Open. Open image. All right. Maybe I have to go to the website. There we go. Okay. I got it. I got it. Sorry for the sorry for the silence and the delay. I'm still trying here. You know, I'm I'm new to YouTube. There we go. 
fade. It's adorable. Adorable. It's adorable. Ador. Never mind. You can giggle at that. That was funny. Um, <clears throat> what kind of pants does Mario wear? Denim, denim, denim. <laughs> Yay, dad jokes. All right, back, back to it. We got all the doors up there. That's good for tonight. What happened here? What is this? Did I do this? Ugh. Ugh. I think the lag's got me. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. We made it to 30 minutes. I'm tired, but that's fine. It's Friday. Be sure to tune in to the karaoke tonight at 9.30. We're going to be singing. We're going to be on our microphones. La, la, la. That's what karaoke stands for in Japanese. Uh, tone deaf. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things that I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos uh, without threat and without promises of anything. Uh, love you guys very much. Have a great night. And we will talk to you very soon. PAX East is coming up soon. I'm, I'm ready for it. What's that thing I say at the end of the videos? Steven, is it? Oh yeah. Outro. That was a fade. You don't, you don't fade the outro. You just, you hit it. Ready? Try this again. Outro. No, 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 no. Try deeper, deeper voice. Outro. Outro. No, then I popped the microphone. That's horrible. Try this again. <clears throat> Take seven. Outro.